I'm Dana Roselli right now in your 13 Action News update. Developing news, Metro confirms a person was grazed by a bullet in an apartment complex near Nellis and Stewart. While a suspect is in custody and details are very limited, but as we learn more, we will of course update you. And crews were called out to that office building on Paradise and Flamingo again after reports of a possible flare up. After getting to the scene though and seeing no smoke or flames, crews were cleared. This marks the second time this week that firefighters were called back out to the scene on Monday, a huge fire destroyed several businesses, leaving many of the owners with nothing. And today you have one last chance to help kids across the valley avoid the so-called summer slide. 13 Action News is helping to keep minds engaged and stop that summer slide with Summer Rise and our book drive. You can drop off books at dozens of locations across the valley through the end of the day. For the full list of locations, go to ktnv.com slash summer rise. This 13 Connect Summer Rise community campaign is sponsored by Subaru of Las Vegas and America First Credit Union. Justin, happy first day of summer. Right back at you, Dana. We've got temperatures that are oh, about five degrees cooler than average. So instead of that typical late June uh, high temperature forecast around 100, we're going to keep it in the mid 90s. Not bad for a Friday. A lot of sunshine out there. A little 20 mile per hour gust from time to time. Down to a low of 70 tonight, quite possibly upper 60s away from the city. Highs on Saturday only around 91. That could tie a record cool high temperature for the date tomorrow. We'll take it 96 Sunday, but a reality check all of next week. We're back toward 100 and the breezes will return. All right, that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktnv.com and our free mobile app. Have a great weekend, everyone.